Hello, viewer. Thank you very much for watching Gift TV. Today's video is going to be brief. You'll be looking at Aita AI, how you can subscribe to this particular AI, and then also how you can use this AI appropriately. So let me quickly share my screen so that I can walk you through the Aita AI. Okay, once you open your browser, you type in Aita AI, so this particular interface will come. So once you get this particular interface, all that you need to do, okay, is to type in the, the title that you want to work with. Or if you want to first subscribe, you go to pricing, okay? Once you click on pricing, you will get this. So you have to choose your plan. If you want to choose the monthly plan that is about $25 per month, or you will go by the three months plan, okay? Or you go by the yearly, okay, the annual plan, then you can choose this one. So assuming you want to go by the monthly plan, you just have to click on get it now. Okay, once you click on it, okay, it will ask you to pay. Okay, so this is the, the one that you want. So once you click on this monthly, this is the interface. So all that you need to do, okay, is to just uh, select your email, then it will bring you to this interface. Then once you get this interface, you have to put in your Visa card or MasterCard, debit card, okay, or credit card um, credentials in. So the card number, you put it here, the expiration date, there's the, the month and the year, then the three digit code at the back of the card, then the zip code where uh, you reside or you got the card from. So that is where you have to, these are the information that you have to put in. Then you, uh, you select this, you check this. And once you check, then you click subscribe, then it will get you in. All right. So after you're doing all these things, the most important aspect of data AI is the job that is going to do for you, okay? The most important thing of the data AI is the job that is going to do for you. So here, once you get the interface of the data AI, so this is where you come and type or put in your command, okay? So assuming that you want data AI to create methodology session for the title or the topic that you are writing about. Then you have to make sure that as part of the command that you are putting in, you add the concept of methodology. So if you wanted to add, if you want ITA AI to write literature, you have to add literature as part of the command. Okay, so for example, if I want ITA AI to help me create methodology, okay, I will just put in my command, create methodology for the impact of education and economic growth in Ghana. Okay, so once I'm done, I'll just click on create for free. So you have to select how long you want the essay or the draft to be. You want in three to five pages. You want more than that. So you have to set all those parameters. Then you click next. So you have to also set in terms of how you want the the entire document to look like or sound is very important. So, so you have to pick the tone of voice. Is it going to be analytical, causal, okay, in terms of objective, descriptive? Do you want it casual? Do you want it informative? Do you want it formal or persuasive in terms of the tone? Okay, so I want it analytical. So I click on it, okay, then I click next. All right, so here you have to also select the style of references. So we go by the APA, then I click next. Because I add a methodology, you observe that it will bring the entire table of content together with our methodology. Okay, if I omit that there is no way it's going to bring uh, along with methodology session. Okay, so any of the concept that is of essence or critical to you, you have to make sure that you add it to the command that you are putting in as part of um, the, the prompt that you are putting in for ITA to generate for you. Once you are done, you can explore all the sessions, introduction, background, theoretical framework, literature, methodology. And if you look at the methodology session, it gives you the research design, the approach, the data collection method, variables and measurement, the data, the data analysis plan, Okay, in terms of descriptive and regression analysis, it gives you all these sessions for you to appreciate the use of ITA AI. 
Okay. So this is what I, I want to share with you for today. I'll do more videos on ITA to show you how you can continue to exploit. Thank you very much for always subscribing and sharing our videos. Continue to like and share our videos so that YouTube will recommend our videos for others to also work. Thank you.